Hey guys, how's it going? Apex here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to create a bootable USB drive for Windows 10 on an OS 10 based system. So to start off by ensuring that you have a flash drive that is at least 8 gigs that is plugged into your Mac, and then spotlight search for disk utility. From here, click on the USB drive itself, not any previously created partition, and then you can partition your drive as MS-DOS FAT under the master boot record scheme. Alternatively, you can erase your drive under the MS once again under the MS-DOS format, and yet again, of course, under the master boot record scheme. Once that process has been completed, visit the first link in the description, which will take you to a Microsoft web page that hosts the different versions of Windows 10 that you can download. Of course, you're going to want to download a version of Windows based on whether your PC supports a 64-bit operating system or not, and depending on what version of Windows 10 you have a product key for. And so once your version of Windows 10 has finished and has finished uh, downloading, you want to spot a search for bootcamp, and click continue, click OK, and then just ensure that you only have created Windows 7 or later version install disk selected. Click continue. And here you're going to want to choose the, or sorry, locate the ISO image that you just downloaded. So I'm going to go to my download, downloads folder and click this. And then ensure that the destination disk for the installation process is the USB drive that we formatted earlier. Click continue click continue again and it will begin the process of formatting your drive and copying the applicable Windows installation files this process could take a little bit of a while it, for me it took about uh, I believe it was between half an hour and an hour so just hang tight and I'll be back once everything has been completed once the process has been completed, it should say that your bootable USB drive has been cr created. And that's pretty much it. You should now be able to use your USB as a bootable device for your Windows 10 installation. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If, if you did, definitely drop a like. And with that being said, I'm Apex, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.